Hello, good night. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Oscar. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you, teacher. I'm okay. I'm very happy. Today is Friday, Oscar. <laughs> oh, really? It's okay. It's okay. Lucia, cuidado. How was your day today? I'm fine. Okay. That's very well, very, very well. All right, that's good. That's good to know. Okay. All right, we're gonna- I'm waiting for, for the other classmate. Yes, of course, thank you. Okay, thanks. Thank you. All right, guys, welcome to another class. It's eight o'clock already, so we're going to start. Hi, Daniel. Hi, Anna. Can you hear me? Hello, teacher. How are you? Hi. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. Excellent. Very good. How was your day, Danny? Did you work today? No. no um, tomorrow. <laughs> oh, okay. Yes, yes. Today is relaxed at, at, my, at my home. That's nice. <laughs> So are you going to start morning shift or, I mean, day shift or night shift? Mm, day shift, for day shift. Okay. Um, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. All right, okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. But usually it's busier on like during the day, right? Yes, it's, it's, more, busy, it's more busier in the day at, uh, versus at night. Yeah. All right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah, I understand mm -hmm. that. Very good. Okay. Let's see. I have Vanessa Reyes also, Carla Michelle, and Claudita. Excellent, guys. We're going to start. Um, so today, the idea is to present your presentations about the product that you guys have been working on. All right. So the idea is that mid-class, like after nine, we're going to start presenting Hopefully most of your classmates will be with us. All right, but then we'll see. All right, so that's the plan that we have for today. I'm going to show you the book. Just give me a second here because I didn't get it out before. All right, so yesterday we were, oh, that, that's the last thing we did. I'm just gonna share my book with you right now. All right, so we have this 
this is the transition words for addition. And we were using this for the paragraphs. Recuerdan que ayer casi al final de la noche, I asked you to write a paragraph, cada quien individual, and then you went to your groups and you chose one. All right, yes, the one is supposed to be on your on your slide number six. Okay, where uh, in this paragraph you are supposed to have included words of transition of addition, for example, furthermore, moreover, in addition, what's more, also. All right, that was the whole idea to write the paragraph. Igual, we're going to see this later, all right, when we start sharing your presentations. Okay, so here we have this. Based on this is that you guys made your questions yesterday for the focus group questionnaire. And that was pretty much um, the end of unit two yesterday, all right? So today, vamos a darle cierre, basically, at the unit two with your presentations, okay? We may, we're going to re make some review and everything, but we are going to go on right now thinking that we are going to um, start unit three para darle más tiempo a los demás compañeros que se unan and then we can share the whole um, presentations, all right? So let's see here, guys. We have unit three. I will be able to describe the benefits of building a new product prototype before manufacturing, all right? Now, number one, let's start. Um, Oscar, can you please read number one? What does? Okay. What does prototype mean? What type of new product, in your opinion? Require the building of a prototype before mass production. Does your company make use of prototype? Excellent, thank you, Oscar. Very good. Remember, guys, esta pronunciación es building. La u es muda. All right, we don't say build building. We say building. All right, very good. So, what does prototype mean? I'm going to stop sharing this for a second. All right. Hi, Walter. Hi, Ever. Domingo. Hello. Uh, Vanessa. Also, Carlita and Debbie. Good evening, girls and guys. Good evening. Thank you. All right. So what is a prototype? Who can tell me what a prototype is? What is a prototype? Anybody? Prototype is a, it's a principal idea where, where you where you take the, the idea and in 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 how say to move to to art, article but is the first article you con como se dice construir o armar construir yeah. uh -huh. Uh -huh. is the first the first article you can you build ah. if you in, in in this prototype you can see the errors uh, mm. and you can you can use it you can see the advantage or we can this all right okay mm -hmm. I, okay interesting thank you anybody else wants to add to the information that danny just gave us what is prototype for you guys what is a prototype any ideas or more ideas because Daniel already gave us some. Teacher, I think a chord with Daniel is a, is a scale mold okay. about the, 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 the main, the main uh, uh, product or the main decided product is uh, uh, in a scale model. Uh, is, is to need to show uh, uh, the uh, one thing or expose about one uh, uh, people of the company about the, the new design of the, mo of the product. Okay. okay, I hear you. Ah, interesting. You see, that's it. Very nice because Daniel already gave us some information, but ever complements what um, Daniel is saying with all the words, which that's pretty cool. Thank you, Evan. Anybody else? What is a prototype for you? 
Anybody that can help us with the definition of prototype? Nope, no definitions. Let's see, Maria. Yes, Maria. Yes. Maria. Hey. <laughs> I read Mariano, what is a for me, a prototype is the uh, concept product, okay. uh, a build concept product. Oh, yes, uh, for 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 the test, the final product, you can expose or can buy. Okay. No. All right. Okay, interesting. Now, let's see here, guys. I just want to ask you something else. Now, do you think that any new product needs a prototype? Every new product that people make and think, do they build a prototype before the real product? Yes? Yes, teacher. Why? Yes, teacher. Okay, Anita, tell me why. And then Mariano, uh huh. Why do you think that, Anita? I think they need it, you know, because the people don't know like the functionality on all that stuff. Because sometimes it's really hard to see the things in, I don't know, uh, annuncios, but it is not the same in the physics. Uh, Sorry? In ads, ads are annuncios. Okay. Publicity, right? Okay. Yeah. So it's not the same as to feel it and to touch it and to see it, right? Just, okay, very good. Mariano? Just to share, I think every product needs to design or a prototype because you need to test the product before to, ¿cómo sería lanzar? Launching? Launching the, a new product. Okay, all right, very good. What about the rest of you guys? What do you guys think? Debbie, Walter, Oscar, Domingo, Rafael, Vanessa. What do you guys think? Do you think that every product, every new product has to have a prototype? Yes, no, maybe. Yes, because it's, uh, it's a way to have testing and improve the final product to offer the client. Okay, all right, very good. Okay, so that's what we're talking about today, guys, for the ones who just joined us. Uh, now, in the company that you work, that you guys work for, do you have prototypes of any kind? Do you build prototypes? Do you um, have products? And before the product, do you have a prototype prior to that? In my case, teacher, uh -huh. it is not like a prototype, but something similar. Okay. Where, uh, for a procedure, it is like a testing, you know? But I think it is always a prototype. We always do a... Uh, uh, test about it to see how much is gonna influence in the people that kind of things. Okay, all right. Interesting, Anita. Very good. You're like in a because you're like in a clothing um industry, right? Yes. Yeah. All right. Okay, I hear you. Very good, Mariano. What about in your case? Do you use prototypes? Do you like? Do you deal with products and before the product you have a prototype? Yes, it's sure. In same case, uh -huh. necessary for testing and validate for the client okay. the the current application for different products. Okay. And the next the next step is to uh, to el elaborate the product. Okay. Okay. All right. Very good. What about the other guys? What about the rest of you guys? Do you work with prototypes? Any type of product? Teacher, can, can, can be a prototype you want a product create for the company uh, but uh, test the advantage of, of other 
a rotor character it's uh, this product we need yeah yeah i think so i i guess it is like just like anita said i guess in every industry in one in in some industry a prototype is such as a prototype right but in other ones uh there are other kind of things that you may call also like a prototype because you're testing to see if it works to see if people like it to see if people are going to use it to see how it fits so yeah i think those um those can be those types of prototypes by the way all right interesting let's see i'm gonna take the first attendance guys and then we keep on talking about these prototyping things all right so if you guys have you're up there please let me know and i'm gonna take the attendance right now just let's see here abner hold on today is the 20th right all right abner uh eli fuentes flores adela trinidad gonzalez consuegra thank you claudia guadalupe arias de gomez daniel antonio luna Present teacher. Domingo Alexander Gonzalez. Present teacher. Present teacher. Present teacher. Okay, Carla Benazir Lara Gonzalez. Carla Michelle Brizuela Portillo. Present teacher. Thank you. Carla Vanessa Vázquez de Ayala. Kevin Esteban Mejibar Merino. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. You, Mariano Jose Paca Santa Maria. Present teacher. Thank you. Oscar Arnulfo Villatoro Herrera. Present. Rafael Ernesto Hernández Sandoval. Salvador Present teacher. Salvador Augusto Sorto Rivas. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemus. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Present. Thank you. Ana María Palacios Araujo. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. And David Jasmine Giron Ramírez. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, guys. Okay. So let's continue then, guys, with this. Ah, uh, Roberto, sí. Yes, Roberto, thank you. I just saw you. <laughs> thank you, Roberto. All right, so let's go back here then. Let's continue with the book. We are already beginning unit three. All right, so we can start advancing with this. All right, so we were talking exactly about num exercise number one, page 25 of your book. All right, now let's let's do this conversation. It says Tom and Diana are discussing ideas to begin prototyping a new bicycle model. Read the conversation and take turns practicing. All right, so Debbie, can you please be Diana? And let me see here. All right, Mariano, yeah, go ahead, Mariano. You can be Tom. Thank you. Okay, good. The X. Alert Aleppo has green like to be produced new. We need to work on the prototype. prototype. Great. Great. I think our best choice is to, to hire a steel master so they build a good prototype to help us spot any flaw we, have, we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very acquiring, acquiring accurate with the design, accurate with the design of the handle bars, the frame and the sander, Battle? which are the which are the innovative. Of the X Alleratory. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. 
totally then you work on the schedule, sketch of the parts and you mean want to start with the description and the specification of each. So still masters start working. All right. All right, thank you guys. Let's see. I need two more volunteers to read this the conversation, please. Just two. Anna, do you want to go ahead? Thank you, Anna and Ever. I don't know. Anna, are you available right now? Yes. Okay. So Anna, you're Diana, and Ever, you're Tom. The accelerator okay. has green light to be produced. Now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire steel masters. So they build a good prototype to help us spot any flaw we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlance bars, the frame and the saddle, saddle, I think, which are the innovative features of the X elevator? Mm -hmm. Good, good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I will work on the sketch of the parts, and you might want to start with the description, description and a, spe a specification of each. So still masters start working. All right. Excellent guys, very well done. Thank you so much for that reading. Uh, let's see, two more volunteers and the last two. Volunteers to be Diana, volunteers to be Tom. No, it does the boy any, any mini mini mo? Okay, no problem. All right, let's see. So, um, Oscar, can you please be Diana? And Carla Vanessa, can you please be Tom? Ya ven, igual voy, ini mini mini mo is ya sale. Sorry. <laughs> okay, okay. The ex aliator has green light to be produced. Now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire a steel masters so they do a good prototype to help us spot any flaw we haven't identified it in the design. I agree, Tom. The, the prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the sign of the handlebars, the frame and the saddle which are the innovative feature of the eggs later. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what, what we want. Totally. Then I work in the sketch of par. And you might want to start with the description and the specification of each. So, a still master, a star work. All right. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you, Carla Vanessa. Excellent, guys. Very good. Very well done. I mean, everybody's reading really well. All right. We just need to check some pronunciation, not everything, but we just need to remember. I'm just going to highlight it, como siempre aquí, just for you guys to take notes. All right. Hay unas palabras que ya las, ya las hemos uh, venido viendo. La idea es que usted las apunte de alguna forma o algún lado para eh, que siempre se acuerde, ¿verdad? Esta, please, guys, esta es importantísima. Se lo voy a poner en rojo. Build, all right? La U es muda. Y olvide que existe la U ahí. All right? No existe, es build. Uh, let's see. Flow. All right? We have flow, spot. Voy a subrayar las que yo creo que tal vez no sabemos total significado o que nos ha costado un poquito uh, the pronunciation. So this one too. Ow. Let's see here. Esta ya la hemos visto y la vamos a volver a poner. 
Ok. Estas se van porque son nuevas. Busquen ahí alguna otra si yo no la he subrayado, please. Todavía. Okay. Esta se ha visto en algún momento. ¿Y qué es el doctor? Ah, ya, ya le voy a decir. Ya lo voy a subrayar también. Just give me a second. Accelerator is the model of the bike. It's yes. like a, it's like a model name. Uh -huh. I think. Yes, yes mm -hmm. you're right. Very good. Okay. Igual. I'm just gonna highlight it here. Accelerator. Accelerator. Uh, Domingo is just como decía Daniel el nombre de la nueva bicicleta que se han inventado. All right. It's the accelerator. All right. It's it's a name. Okay. Okay. Revise ahí si se me, se me fue otra eh, que usted necesite saber, ya sea to pronounce. Ay, aquí hay una mía de mis favoritas. Esa la vamos a poner en verde. ¿Sabe por qué, verdad? No saben. Por la D. Por la E, exacto. All right, yeah. A esta altura ya la sabemos pronunciar beautifully, right? Very good. Okay, guys. So here we have accelerator is the name of the bicycle produced. All right. Built, spot, flaw, identified, manufacturers, accurate, handlebars, frame, saddle, features, ensure, a sketch. All right. Sketch. A sketch. Yes. Very nice. Okay. So. Uh, anybody, vamos ahí. ¿Sabe qué? Le voy a tomar yo foto para tenerla acá y poderlos ver mientras me pronuncian. Just give me a second, guys. So I can just... Lo mismo, no verlos. All right, volunteers. To start pronouncing those words, guys, please. Mariano, Mariano. Como siempre, se volunteer, entonces por eso es number one in everything. No, cuéntenos. Todas. Flow, ventify, manufacturers, accurate, handlebar, frame, subtle, subtle, saddle, 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 mm -hmm. saddle. Fe features, excellent, ensure, ensure sketch, ensure como la marca de esa bebida, verdad, ensure, ensure, right, ensure, right, so no, it's ensure. All right, very good. Okay. Y la otra es sketch, very good. Ya no vayan a andar diciendo en sure, sino que en sure. Y no van a decir, ¿qué es eso, right? But you say, I know what I'm talking about. Very good. Okay, guys, let's see. Very good, Mariano, thank you. A ver, ¿quién más? Ini, mini, mini, mo. Excellent, Rafael, thank you. Uh -huh. Okay, teacher. Steel Master. Build, identified, manufacture, handlebars, acquire, sander, communications, catch. All right, okay, so you have that. Ones. Okay, that's fine. All right, that's okay. Thank you. A ver, okay. anybody else? Thank you, Rafael. Anybody else? No more volunteers. No. Wow, va a ser viernes tonight. Mi teacher, mi teacher. Thank you, Dani. Uh, produce, build, flow, manufacturers, accurate, handlebars, frame, saco, features, ensure, stick. A ver, ensure. 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 
All right. Y la otra. I'm sure. Daniel no es accurate, es accurate. Sin el eight. Ac accurate. Ajá. Uh -huh. Accurate. Accurate. Okay. Excellent. Very good. A ver, ini, mini, mini, mo. Ajá. Es que no sé los que están con camarita apagada. Yo sé que Anita sí, pero los demás no sé si están por ahí. A ver. Um, Trini. ¿Está por ahí Trini? ¿No? Escucho cortado, pero ojalá no me escuchen cortado. Okay. Build. Spot. Flow. Manufacturer. Accurate. Frame. Ensure. Yes, Trini. Very good. Yes. And then we have a sketch and features, I think. Thank you, Trini. All right. Let's see. Debbie. Aha, uh -huh, Debbie. Cuéntenos. Excelator. Excelator. Excel. 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 Excelator. Ya me introdujo a mí. Produce, build, spot, flow, identify, manufacture, or manufacture, manufacturers. Manufacturers. Manu. Manufacturers. Uh -huh. Manufacturers. Excellent. Okay. Accurate. Uh-huh. Handlebars. Yes. Frames. Uh, Sand. Saddle. Uh, saddle. Yes, saddle. Uh, la, fi, esa se me, fi, fi, ah, features. 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 Uh -huh. Features. Ensure. Y sketch. Excellent, thank you. Y el último o la última. Ajá, uh -huh. who's next? No? Oh, all right. You guys. Me, teacher. Thank you, Anita. You make me happy. Thank you. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> I just. Uh, accelerator, produce, build, spot, flow, identify, manufacturers. Accurate handlebars, frame, saddle, features, ensure, 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 sketch. Very good. All right. Thank you. All right. Very good, guys. Thank you, Anita. You were the last one here. Okay. Pónganla ahí ustedes. Yo sé que se las tienen ahí. Accelerator, produced. Hay una D al final. Produce. No puedo decir nada más produce. It's produced. All right. It's like D at the end, produced, build, very good, spot, all right, no es spot, no es una O como nuestra, es a spot, all right, it's a spot here, all right, flow, eh, identified, no es identified, it's identified, manufacturers, accurate, handle, handlebars, frame, saddle, features, ensure, and a sketch, okay? All right, no sé si necesitan que le repita alguna. Do you want me to repeat any of the words or you guys are okay? You guys are fine? Excellent, very nice, I like that. You guys are pro. All right, entonces, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Uh, my next question is, do we understand the meaning of all of these words? De las que yo subrayé. Do we understand the meaning? Do we know what they mean? Do you have any no. questions? Okay, no, Debbie. Please. All of them. Uh, features. Uh, features. Features. Right, the pronunciation, Debbie. All right, features. A ver, ¿quién me ayuda con features? What are features? Colaboración. ¿Qué? Es como colaboración. No, hoy no, no. No que yo sepa, Mariana. Mm. A ver, features, what is features? Características. Exacto, características. What are the features of your product? What are the characteristics of your products? All right. Mariano, puede ser que en otro contexto pueda ser que eso pueda, quiera decir, pero tendríamos que verlo, Mariano, ok? Ok, Tisha. All right, very nice. So features are like characteristics. Very good. Another one. 
Subtle teacher. Oh, very good, thank you. Subtle is montura. En otras palabras, el asiento de la bici. All right, cuando usted, si usted se sube en un caballo, ahí sí dice the saddle of the horse. All right, you put a saddle on the horse. Okay, saddle is el asiento. Any other? Handle frame. Ah, frame, muy bien. Frame, eh, Anita, imagínese una bicicleta, entonces todo el, ¿qué sería? El chasis. El marco. El marco. El marco, chasis. el marco, el marco de bicicleta. Mm. Ahí, cerca, uh -huh. okay. Todo eso, ese es el frame. Ahora, okay. eh, usted puede. Frame, frame es marco o chasis. O el, lo que va en el, mar, el marco es, ajá, sí. Ajá. Le va el asiento, le van los pedales, todo eso. Exacto. En otro ah, okay. momento, si usted va y se toma una foto y anda buscando un frame, entonces es un marco, literal, el marco donde poner una foto. Okay. Ah, ok. All right, very good. It's raining. No, Handlebars, no. I think, is el maniobre. Yes, el, el... yes, el maniobre donde usted va agarradito ahí de la bici. Very good. Those are handlebars. All right. And a sketch, teacher. Yes. Very good. I'll work on the sketch. Puede ser que el sketch sea como un dibujo, así. Un... Bosquejo. Bosquejo, gracias. Thank you, Mariano. What would I do without you? All right. It's a bosquejo. It's raining. Bosquejo oh. o borrador. Sí. Ajá. All right. Yes, Anita. Right. Okay. Yes, teacher. Excellent. A spot y flow. Me faltan esas dos. No sé si saben el significado. A spot en este contexto, porque spot tiene otro significado. A spot pueden ser eh, un. Manchas. No, una mancha, exacto. I have a spot on my skirt. Puede ser spot de los, um, o sea, tiene una falda, un vestido, una camisa y tiene, tiene circulitos. Círculos. Ajá, eso es un spot. Ahora, este, para cosas de advertising, por ejemplo, de, de, de anuncios, un spot es un anuncio también. Pero en este contexto, permítame aquí, solo lo vuelvo a poner, es detect, uh, help us spot, es detectar cualquier error. Flow es error. All right. Entonces, en este contexto, perdón, contexto, spot es detectar. No es mancha, no es círculo, no es los otros meanings. All right. Teacher. Yes, Mariana. ¿De qué otra forma se podría decir eso? Si no el spot en el flow. Excuse me? ¿De qué otra forma lo podríamos decir? O sea, detectar un error me suena. Muy rara esa palabra. Vea que yo podría decir de otra forma. 